you guys this is actually part two of my hawaii travel vlog so if you haven't already please watch part one first i'm gonna go ahead and link it down below um, and then you can come back to this video and watch this one um, obviously i'm sharing very different things on both videos so uh, it'd be helpful to see what we checked out in the first half of our trip we are now on day four um quick outfit of the day this is actually my friend arthi's this is from Abercrombie, I think she got it from. How old is she? She's in high school? Same swim top as I've been wearing. These pants are from Anthropology. Same Tevas I've been wearing. It's our earliest day today and we are now headed out. Look at this unreal color of the water. Just picked up some lychee. back to Leonard's because it's just too good. We love Leonard's. Our favorite flavor is cinnamon. We got straight six of the cinnamon this time. Look at the fluffy lusciousness. Woo! Oh my god. I need to protect these. Another place we just picked up is Ono Seafood. Another repeat place that I'm wanting to emphasize that we got again because it is so freaking good. We got the number seven, which is spicy ahi, which is tuna. Here it is. Shout out to the most unbelievable poke and ocean, I forget the name, salad. So good. Took another break and now we're gonna head to the mall. Um, this is my Amazon cover up, the swimsuit and swim bottoms I usually wear. We're doing Foodland Poke. Why did I say it weird? 
Foodland Poke at Ala Moana Beach. This is from Foodland. This has watermelon, honey, lime juice, and mint. There's a rainbow. It is actually kind of sprinkling a little bit, so we are probably gonna get some rain while sitting here. Check out this sunset, you guys. It looks absolutely beautiful right now. So pretty. So today is day five. I'm wearing this dress from H&M and this top is from somewhere in England, I think. Today we are headed to brunch right now. And then after that, we're actually gonna go and get some laundry done because Zoheb has like zero clothes now, but a lot of my clothes are dirty too, and it would be nice to have them cleaned. Here it is. There's a long line, which is probably a good indication of how it is. Surprise, surprise, we are back at Ono. But this time I got half salmon and half uh, tuna. It's a temple gold. Oh wow. Oh my god. It's a temple gold. Both delicious. Look at how beautiful our background is right now. Oh my gosh. Just got a glimpse of the temple. Headed there now. Look at how epic this background is. Oh wow. This is beautiful. Look at how beautiful it is. The bell up close. In love with this place. We take our shoes off for this portion. Another koi pond. Oh wow. So many koi fish. about to hike to Leaky Leaky Falls but I had to park on the side of the road outside of this gate because it closes at 4 this is a walk look at this mountain range flower up on the trees came across this look at this how nice
amazing. And we just did the falls. It was a really nice hike. One thing I was going to say, the tricky part, which was helpful for me to read on all trails, is that when you come to a crossroads, there's a fallen tree with a green arrow pointing towards the right, and that is the correct way to go for the falls. So in case you happen to attempt this fall, keep that in mind. Are you guys seeing this highway drive? Are you kidding me? It's glorious. Repeat food, we're back for fete. This is the grilled cheese sandwich in their house soda. Zoe just like described this perfectly. He said it tastes like a grilled cheese and tomato soup in one. And that's so true. Look at the sunset view right now. It's our sixth day here in Hawaii, so tomorrow unfortunately is our last day. Um, so this is one of the final outfit of the days, but this is that same yellow swim top you've seen me wear, and these bottoms are actually my mom's. I think she either got it from Forever 21 or Anthropology. Shoes haven't changed. Guess who got Wyola again? We are trying to go to Secret Beach today. Among the mountains, it's so nice. There is a sign that says no swimming, and if you can tell, there's so many surfers out, which is really neat to see them do that. a good parking spot it's like right when you enter so now let's walk over to the secret beach so as you can see this is the highway and then these are the steps to go down oh look at it oh how cool is that the way down is scary Bye, Secret Beach. That's the highway again. Store Just page. picked up some bubble tea because I like the packaging. That's literally the reason. It's called S7 Icy Bubble. Not gonna lie, I'm feeling a kind of way about this being our last day on the beach. It's so calming to just lay on the beach and hear the waves and just chill this way. So I'm gonna miss that. Let me show you guys my view right now. It's so nice. We're 
back in the hotel. Another epic sunset right here from our window. I look directly below, <laughs> look how high up we are. We're on the 19th floor. But the city, it just gets lit up in the most perfect way at sunset. And we're going to a fancier dinner place tonight than we've done so far. So um, this is my swim top, which I'm using in a fancy way. And then this is my skirt. This is from, oh my gosh, oh, Zara. I'm not wearing the Tevas. I'm wearing these. Yay, finally wearing some normal sandals. So here we are at the MW. Getting my car. <laughs> The restaurant is actually above this car dealership. This is so cool. More cars. As we're waiting for our table, just looking at these extremely luxurious cars. What an interesting location for a restaurant. This drink is called Blue Valentine, I think. I'll go ahead and put the ingredients somewhere because it sounded so interesting and fun to me. It was $10. Just got a complimentary dish. This drink is delicious and this is a starter that we just got. Our last day here in Hawaii, our flight is tonight to go back to the mainland. Um, so sad. This is gonna be like the final outfit of the day and it's really just like airport clothes. It's just this white tank top, this cardigan from Madewell and these Texas sweatpants I got from like a UT co-op store back when I was in undergrad. And then these shoes are Adidas Ultra Boost. First thing we're gonna do today is go back to Ala Moana Center, which is our freaking mall. Like, I think it is my most favorite mall ever. I'm wanting to get a t-shirt I spotted that's Hawaii themed at a store called Uniqlo. There it is, our number one store. We don't have a Uniqlo in Texas, so we have been loving this. Like, look at this. Just got this shirt from Uniqlo. Picked up Ono oh Poke for one last time. Now we're at Wyola Ice to get that for one last time. these gorgeous palm trees. It's crazy to imagine what once was.
My phone is taking a video of their phone. Last look here at this beautiful building. Wow, absolutely gorgeous. And the weather is perfect and the palm trees are blowing and there's birds flying. I mean, what a beautiful location for a palace. Looks like right across the street is a beautiful building as well. Hawaii visitors bureau marker first sign of art in this neighborhood no, this is all yeah like mural street art Absolutely amazed with this girl. This is, I think, my favorite. Oh, I love this. the Whole Foods here have Hawaiian specific flowers. Oh, look at all these tropical bouquets. Juice right here. Trying the Dr. Hagu pineapple, apple, ginger, and orange. We are returning our bougie car. I'm gonna miss this car so much. So sad. First of all, thank you so much for following along our Hawaii journey. 
I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, please leave it down below. I'm going to go ahead and put a list in the description of things we didn't get to do or didn't necessarily prioritize in our itinerary, but some other ideas of what to do. We are going to enjoy Chipotle now. I don't know when my next trip is yet, but I have some really exciting art videos coming up. If you enjoy these videos, please like and subscribe and I'll see you for the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye.